Alright, it would appear that I am live. So... Get this here. Oh, I, don't, I don't have a mute button, that would have made sense to set up, but I didn't set it up, so we're just doing it. I'm super tired, so please forgive me, this is gonna go horrible. I haven't practiced this game in forever. But, I'm gonna try and do it for charity. So right off the bat we have this first trick where we manipulate the Technodrome spawn and it never works for me, so we're not doing that. I'm just gonna hit start here wherever. <laughs> Walk around this first tunnel. Sorry if it's your favorite. I intentionally don't kill a lot of enemies on there to keep the enemy kill count low. <laughs> and I intentionally took a lot of damage there because the turtles get a damage boost whenever they are low on health. Ah, uh, unless it's Raphael. He gets no damage boost. Fly off screen, it's fine. Who needs them? Missing a lot of hits here, but that's okay. Still an easy fight. Everybody's favorite level. I'm gonna be taking a lot of safe strats here though. Bump my head there a little bit to delay to line up with those. I think they're supposed to be wasps. Like if you play the other versions of the game, they're very clearly wasps. But not so much in this game. Just walk around those. Speed strats there. Oh, okay. That's fine. Everything's fine. Go away, dude. Tight little jump there. Kinda surprised I made it, to be honest. <laughs> Taking a while to set up that... that uh, extended jump is what they like to call it. Don't miss this. There we go. <laughs> Best music in the game. Hopefully it's not too quiet. I'm gonna go ahead and switch here. You have to f swim far enough in that screen to activate the underwater current. If you go immediately out the top, the current doesn't get activated and it makes this whole section quite a bit slower. The second part to it is not bumping into things, like I just bumped into that. <laughs> Getting very lucky on these uh, lightnings, though. Don't push it. Raphael has a ton of health, but well, 
go through here and then I'll switch to mic. I want to take some damage on Mike because I'd like Mike to die in a bit. Not yet. <laughs> but I'm also terrible at the game right now, so I'm not going to take too much damage. Just in case. Mike gets to die because it just fits the rotation the best, really. And when I was first learning this game, I used to kill off Raphael, because he seemed the most worthless. I assumed... I, I prefer Raphael over Leonardo now. I feel like Leonardo, Leonardo is pretty, pretty terrible in this game, but other people like the Reach. You must defeat the Foot Clan. His hands sticking through the TV. Get the turtle wagon, the party wagon. That wonderful animation of just shaking. Not even taking that damage boost, even though it would be really easy to do so. Very slight stutter right there drops him through the floor. And then I fall off the ladder for some reason because I can't hold up on my controller. Little extended jump there. And now time for Mike to die. Unfortunately, very slowly. There we go. Irresponsible child. He was just a turtle. It's hard to grow up when you just got oozed and then that's all <laughs> that made you humanoid. Drive through him because we do have quite a bit of life here. Driving that certain way that I kind of half screwed up causes that one to despawn. That almost killed me. Well, not killed, but... <laughs> Wasted my time, almost. Oh god, that actually did not me in, though. <laughs> this is fine. Everything's fine. That's why we have the extra health. Okay, let's just play it safe here. Probably get a bad spawn down here, but that's gonna be okay. Gonna be a okay. <laughs> okay, they actually seem to be back to normal. I would normally never get this pizza, but why not? All I had to do was not jump extra freaking high there. And it's actually pretty free. Alright, 
so these enemies are not the ones that I want. But that's okay. They can swim, Shima. It's just there's a lot of current in the sewer because everybody was watching the Super Bowl and then they all went to the bathroom at the same time. That's Shredder's plan, <laughs> is attack during the Super Bowl to take away the home field advantage. So that guy, his sword actually does zero damage. Me swinging and missing actually does zero damage. Me running into his body, though. Does a fair amount of damage. Oh my god, their breath and hot tub. The concern wasn't the turtles, the concern was April. <laughs> How long she could hold her breath. <laughs> Bad spawns here, again, because I screwed up so much. But we'll just use some old strats, it's all good. Half use some old strats because I'm not good at them anymore. So, here, if you damage boost across, you don't have to use the ropes, and it is faster by a few seconds. I'm not brave enough to do it, certainly, today. And because I'm extra terrible, I'm going to get the Pizza of Shame up here. But we will still go back and do this clip to show it off. What's up, Skunky? If you want to see actual decent running of this, definitely subscribe to Skunky48 there. Even at my best, I was not half as good as he is at this game. So this section all is pretty free. And there's Mikey. Turns out he wasn't dead. He was just tied to a girder. Alright, now this is the only real place where things can go wrong for the moment. <laughs> and they can definitely go horrible. But they turned out okay there. 
So I got a million life. The only thing that can really go wrong then, well, besides running into that, is picking up a bad weapon drop. <laughs> Which I don't think I'm terrible on, but just to be safe. Oh my crap, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, so we still got the bad weapon drop. <laughs> Uh, cause my count was just that far off on the enemies. <laughs> they unmelted him, yeah. I really considered switching back to Mike right there. I thought, well, maybe there's still a chance. But I thought, nah, let's go for it. And I have regretted it ever since. Also running into that. <laughs> it's alright. We don't we we don't need any cheesy. Scroll tricks. Let's see if we can even get through this anymore. It's not normally how I do that. <laughs> That's how I do it. There we go. I'm slow on that. So as you can see, if he pause there, uh, he he shuts his mouth, but the the ball still stays active for whatever reason, and you can still attack it. Uh, if you pause at just the right time when you go in the room, the the ball is a, the hitbox is immediately active, but in a weird place, and you can attack right from the very beginning. See if we can get. If we can even start this clip. There we go. Easy every time. And time to be disappointed because there's no Technodrome here. But that's alright. We'll just kill off Leo. And move on with our lives. <laughs> Just on the off chance that the Technodrome's not in the next spot, I'm going to go get Mike beat up here. Now we're gonna go collect Leo. He was just melted, and now he has been unmelted and tied to a beam. Didn't think he could blow that up in one hit, but apparently he can. Even at full health. That's okay. Imagine that would solve all my problems. I don't believe in metronomes. Yeah, alright, that's cool. So, um... Actually, Mike's lower. So now we kill off Mike. <laughs> to get out of here. This is basically the, the largest time sink that we <laughs> we put into. Uh, you know, the, the worst thing that can happen in this game. Aside from just, like, losing completely.
Thing. This causes the most lost time. Especially when I don't really have any speed strats for any of this other stuff. Aside from just running into things, apparently. Get out of there! Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Ooh, that was actually kind of close. Alright, normally I'd take a face full of lightning here to get the extra damage boost, but we're not doing that. I ran into the the thing. <laughs> so on the plus side, it only worked the first three times and then failed ever since. I bet you could. I bet you could get it going. But yeah, there's so many and so many strats I had on manipulating metronome worked like three times. There was one time where I thought I had it solved, and I had, like, I was getting Technodrome exactly where I wanted it for, like, a week straight. Oh my lord, I'm gonna die. <laughs> At least dying here is not a big deal. But I got it for, like, a week straight, I was like, oh, Technodrome's no big deal. I got it all figured out, and then I never got it again. <laughs> it was just all pure luck. It's the only thing that makes running this game miserable. Like, it's such a fun game aside from that. That's pretty much what drove me to quit. <laughs> Anytime I had a decent pace, I would not get Technodrome. Okay, let's get into the ceiling, please. Play this super safe as well. <laughs> Might as well, right? Oh, not safe enough. <laughs> I forgot that that guy was low. Okay, don't kill me, buddy. One, two, three. I cannot believe that hit me. <laughs> what is that impact? Alright, we're gonna game over here, which is fine. And it's not ideal. <laughs> We're obviously overestimated at this point. But that means we got plenty of turtles to work through here. Still going back to Don. Bad enemy set that will correct itself. This one too, and then I'm gonna miss it. <laughs> my toe, my toe. Like, we all saw that it was not even near my friggin' foot. Can afford to be a little crazier now. Apparently a lot laggier. Right, 
little hop to manipulate those guys up. Another little hop manipulates those guys. Duck it out. Go back to ducking strats here. If I had managed to keep the scrolls, <laughs> then we could do a quick method through here where you chuck scrolls with just the right rhythm and it kills these guys before they can do anything to you. And it's a heck of a lot faster. Duck strats. And now we sit in the corner and we spam. Not too fast or he'll pop out. There we go. <laughs> That is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. You defeated Shredder and saved the world. Now I can turn back to human form. Thanks, you guys have excelled my skills. Oh, Splinter's back to his real form. <laughs> you guys are great. Thanks for your help. Let's celebrate with a pizza. But you know who can't celebrate with a pizza? Hungry kids. So you should give to random acts of kindness so we can give pizzas to those kids. I hope it's pizza. I feel like all the money that we raise should go directly to pizza. I don't know who I need to contact about that. But it should just be nothing but pizza. And if the kids don't like pizza, well then they're gonna starve. Or we'll get them something they like. Because I'm not a monster. We're not monsters. Let's give and get these kids some pizzas and or something they like. <laughs> yep, my <laughs> I don't know where that voice came from. It's just, it's late, man. <laughs> uh, but yeah, up next, we got Toad with Star Wars. I gotta make sure that he's ready, even though it seems like he's ready. Maybe he went to go get a pizza. Alright, he is good to go. So that's all for me. Uh, I'll be back doing a Mega Man run on Sunday morning. So come back for that. It's Mega Man DOS. The ultimate endurance. Well, it's not the ultimate endurance, Mega Man. Mega Man 3 is longer and worse, but. <laughs> Mega Man 3 DOS, anyway. But yeah, uh, stick around for Toad, and thank you guys, and give to the charity. Help us, help us reach our goal, help us feed some kids.